Hi, this is Engineer Hedaitullah, Instructor from School of Civil Engineering. As we have started our Teclated tutorial series, and you know that this is a important software. By using that software, we can design any kinds of element of a structure easily within a minute. Okay, so first of all, I'll open that software and how I'll go with that. Okay. So first of all, what we can do that simply I'll close here and if you need to change unit, I mean in which unit you want to work, you have to first of all select that. So from here, I'll select that and uh, you can see here available that is USA, UK, then Europe, Canada, Australian and Asian. Clear? So first of all, if I click here for US and if I open click here new and what we can do with US US unit here available that are new in software okay so I'll cover everything I'll cover everything of it day by day now first of all I'll just go here for concrete and you know that in our previous lecture I've shown you about that so I'll start serial by serial i will start serial by serial here so first of all i'll just go our anchor bolt design so to design our anchor bolt as per aci code i'll click here so this is for our anchor bolt design and you can read the description here first of all only for tension if you need to design anchor bolt only for tension then you can use that option and only if you need to design anchor bolt for only shear then you can do that option full tension and shear if you need to use that option then you can use that on and then part tension and shear then you can use that option and adhesive anchor example here that is available so what i'll do actually i'll just go here i will we use that option i'll use that option so that i can design any types of anchor bolt and finally if you just see take the following tensile and shear failure mode okay so here this is the scope and limitation and here all limitations then references are available and by using that software you can use aci 318052 aci 318019 even the updated versions work procedure will be same so after that i'll click here continue and here you can see this is the this is our base plate i mean uh, the plan on foundation and here this is your value now what we'll do actually so first of all i'll just you can see here show a sketch for that value so first of all i'll go here for geometry i'll click here this is the value of our geometry plan on foundation this is our foundation plan now ankle layout okay ankle layout in what will be the ankle layout in number number of anchor in x ratio that will be two or three so if you consider three just it will be like that and anchor in y direction that will be two or three if you use three that will be like that so what i'll do i'll use initial as two and i'll use two and here are the spacing so what will be the spacing of it okay what will be the spacing of it so its spacing will be here suppose if i consider 10 inch and here also if i consider 10 inch now concrete exposure you can see here concrete cast against and permanently exposed to earth there are three options actually concrete non exposed to weather or in connected with ground okay so i'll use the first one then here is the value we have to provide for it okay so here we have provided its value that is 20 inch okay concrete exposure and the member thickness so what should be the thickness of our member so i'll consider our member thickness will be 18 inch okay 
our member thickness will be 18 inch and another value so what will be the another value i'll consider that will be 15 and you can see that it are being changed here in that side or in that set clear so all c5 user 15 just see for here and for here the both have changed both have changed now also if you consider here for 15 and also if you consider here for 15 just see fd set it has changed total 13 10 10 10 total 13 and here you have provided a spacing for 10 inch to 10 inch okay so total spacing that is 13 inch i mean 2 feet 6 inch and after that the bolt anchorage details bolt anchorage type so you can see here hooked int bolt anchor hooked int bolt anchor okay this is the sorry headed int and this is the hooked int headed shirt anchor and they have many options as per your record you can use so if i consider that first one then you can select here untorqued or torqued so if we consider torqued and here bolt or anchor details from here dia of anchor bolt so what should be the dia you can also give a respiratory requirement so if i consider that is one inch and adjust number of plate per inch you can click here to adjust it so number of plate per inch you can provide here otherwise you can take it default after that bearing area of height of anchor bolt so what will be that value okay so is the bearing area of head of anchor bolt so what will be that value so if i consider one inch square then embedded depth of anchor bolt that is five inch you can change it anytime then base plate its distance 1.5 inch clear then a coefficient stiffness of a full length embedded section you can use that otherwise leave it so i'll just click ok everything is okay after that i'll click ok now when everything is okay you can see here a total depth here a total depth here a total value everything is available here also if you change and also if you use that option and also if you change its value from here sorry our dimension must be greater or equal to three inch okay so i'll just click here one one i said this is five inch okay and uh this is our standard number of thread and everything here available actually embedded in dimension okay so here already it's given and if i again click okay dimension must be greater or equal to three times of anchor diameter clear so what is our anchor diameter we have to maintain that and less than or equal to 4.5 anchor diameter clear so I'll, if i just give her three and if i click okay then it's okay after that if i click okay just see they have no bolt on bottom clear so in this way you can do it and if you use that option and if you go here and this if this is okay then simply click okay and okay just see again they have the bolt in below in this way you can do it after that materials from here you can select materials as per your requirement so yeah this is the value of our yield distance of steel 36 ksi then nominal tensile strength 58 then a specific compressive strength here also this is for concrete compressive strength 3 ksi you can change it as per your requirement then supplementary reinforcement factor is the factor and concrete modification factor that should be one if you don't want to change then steel tension so as the value for our strength reduction factor 
as per your code so all value are given here and default as per our code i'll not change anything i'll just press ok then i'll go for process so number of bolt row intention you have to select here number of bolt row intention so if i consider uh two the all of our bolt okay in row one or row two that are intention so how much forces it will consider or if you provide here one so that one will take it so if i consider our both two are intention okay so what will be actually when we will use that option tension or nothing so when your value i mean when you have a pull okay pull of your foundation or bolt or base plate then we have to use that option otherwise no need when your foundation are in compression then they have no issue actually with that so suppose if you have tension then you have to use that value here suppose uh, 5 keep and 5 keep same both are 10 keep clear then share first so here's the share first suppose if i consider 2 keep share first and all bolt welded to common plate so it should be if is it welded then it's okay and no bolt applied it to okay so number of bolt applied it to so for one two three four so uh, both two then okay you can also change it as per your requirement as seismic value if available seismic design then you can use that option seismic category which steps of category then if i consider one the seismic uh, requirement not needed here as per that plan then for b then for c and if you go for d then seismic requirement they have many options you can select as per your requirement yes so uh, i'll not consider for seismic value then click ok and you can see here our base plate is finally ok and we have there's the uh, show an output option we'll select all of that option i'll use also that option okay then there be issue our utilization uh, factor our utilization factor here so we're seeing that our section is not economical anymore clear because our utilization factor should be near to 0 0.8 0 0.8 and remember that your value shouldn't be not i mean your value should not be exist less than 0 0.9 clear so this is the safe and economical so anchor tensile strength your wall are available clear now if i go here for geometry and if i consider the depth for 12 okay and if i uh, consider that value for 8 for 8 8 inch and for 8 inch and here if i consider for 10 10 and also here for 10 and here also for 10 and here also for 10 now see what happened then click ok uh, also little bit increase actually in bottom side so the forces there should be um, if i consider here we have 10 and here we have 10 and the share first there should be 3 if we consider actually there have no exact value actually from where we will get that value from our analysis structure analysis we will get that value then if i click ok now we can see that our interaction force this utilization is not okay even our other value here concrete breakout that is 0 0.091 clear and here that interaction force that are not okay and for share share breakout and for this is for share breakout this is for our tension breakout and this is for side share breakout clear so everything is okay actually for all of it that is okay now uh, what i'll do actually again i will just little bit decrease our forces from here eight or eight or two so uh, this time everything is okay clear this time everything is okay and if we uh, go here for materials and from here everything is okay actually i'll not change anything from here and from geometry uh, for our that bolt 
if you consider that fast on if you consider fast on and that is also again uh, die off or bolt if you consider 0 0.5 inch and if i click ok and if i click ok and here now our uh, utilization value have been increased actually in this way you can uh, design or you can do anything then now if i go in option still for which code we want to design so as per sci 31809 i have to design if i click actually there are no change uh, actually uh, sometimes this code do not affect any of our design utilization almost this is almost same this code change for little purpose after that i'll click finish to get our total report so here this is our total project report just see here our total project report with our that value this is for our total value of it that is 16 keep okay our total value of it that is 16 keep and here you can see all of our value is available here right and if you need to save it simply right click then actually if you need if you need to uh, edit that again click here con uh, calculate and it will give you that value so I'll click sorry continue to not cancel I'll click finish and if I right click here and if you click print and from here uh, as I have no printer so I'll use uh, Microsoft or I will use adopt PDF I'll click OK and from here I'll save it anywhere so I'll just go here for our desktop and anchor board design 318 something save and see here is our PDF and you can submit to your client without any problem clear and uh, here this is our design value and finally if I just close it finally if you need to change that value project details or anything simply go here then set up and general environment documents in documents you can little bit change it then template here the company name okay so here yeah, you can change anything company name then address line one two three everything will be available then username and template here also you can use you can uh, change it okay you can uh, change you can change that logo here this is available here also if you need to change you can change it as per your requirement or if you need to blank open just see it will be blank clear and after that also you can edit by clicking here the client this is disabled you can enable that then our project this is the project you can uh, write here for our project then for reference here reference actually everything is available you can change it here as per your requirement suppose if i give here yeah so see then okay then sorry already we have uh, worked working here that's why it will not be not will be able to change i'll click okay so this is the way to design our own of that part so you know next lecture i'll again show you about another part so if you think that that is interesting then is with us and obviously support support us and don't forget to share our course with our engineer friend or any other persons and obviously give us some rating with your comments thank you thank you very much stay connected till next video